Dusty. A little bit of technical dusty, problems I right here. Got some pretty hard hammers. Uh, it's very nice. Yeah. Pretty architecture. The legs and the, this case. morning. I just picked up this piano. The soundboard is in perfect condition. There isn't one crack on it anywhere. It's a little bit dusty. Sometimes rodents live in these things or termites start eating them. Serial number 2520. You can see how dirty. It's a little bit dirty. It's been in somebody's home for 16 years. She bought it for $2,000 in 1999 and had it tuned. The ivory doesn't have any chips on it at all. They're a little bit yellow here and there, but I think I can whiten it back up. But the amazing thing about this piano is that the lady told me it was in tune, so I started to play it and it sounded like it was in tune, but sometimes my ears deceive me. So then I checked it, and it was in perfect tune after 16 years, and I never would have believed it if anyone told me that was that could happen, you know? And when the whole day was over, she gave me a whole bunch of books, and this book was on the top, right here. That book was on the top. All right, so I just picked up this piano, and... Uh, This is D4. So, so you can see this piano has not been tuned in 16 years. D4 on 440 right there.
proof that it's in tune. Amazingly enough, I even just moved it here and it's still in tune. The last piano that I got like this, I paid $250 for it. And after 16 hours of tuning, I broke five strings. This piano is still in tune. I'm I wasn't I figured I wouldn't pick it up, you know, when I was driving out to look at this piano. I was thinking, well, you know, pianos are this old. I don't care what they look like on the outside. I'm tired of working on pianos, you know. Cuz I've got so many pianos. I've got this piano here, of which I've got probably 2 weeks in it, 2 weeks of labor in it. And I want to use it for some final recordings. It's a very beautiful piano. And uh, and then there's this one. This one's a very, very beautiful piano. I mean, it's not just a pretty piano. These pianos really sound nice, okay? And then this piano is incredible. i got to, like, put some more time into this one. It's one of the best players that I've ever played. And it's got one of the nicest sounds of any piano. And then there's a Grinnell in the back of this building here. But... Anyway, I just want to document what's going on because I never thought a piano could stay in tune this long or even for a year, you know?